Welcome to TradesViz. In this video, we will dive into one of the most used tabs of TradesViz, the Trade Explore tab. To explore a trade, you can click on the target icon in any table containing trades. You will find icon this in several parts of your dashboard such as in the Trades Tables, Day Explore, Chart Trades View, Pivot Table, etc. Once on the Trade Explore tab, you will see a page with all the details of the trade you explored. This page includes every piece of information about the trade, from PL to risk metrics, charts, similar trades, tags, notes, and more. Let's explore each section from top to bottom in this NVIDIA trade example. In the top left corner, you will see the PL. The box after that shows you all the information about the symbol you traded along with the side, account ID, trade return percent, and account return percent. Initially, your account return may be blank, but once you fill in your deposits in the Equity Curve tab, the account return will be calculated automatically. Finally, you can click on the Replay button to replay the current trade using the trading simulator. At the right end of this section, you will see a couple of buttons. The right and left arrows can be used to go to the next and previous trades based on the order the trades are in the main trades table. The other buttons are used for trade management and as a shortcut to view other trading tools on TradesViz. The Add button is used to add an execution to this trade and the Delete button can be used to delete the trade and all its information completely. The Edit Trade button can be used to primarily edit the targets, comments, and notes in a single window. Finally, the Sharing button opens a pop-up where you can configure which parts of the Trade Explore page you want to share. It will also show you a unique link that you can use to share your trade with anyone online. The second row is all about shortcuts. The View Day button takes you to the Day Explore page of the date on which this trade was made. We will look at the Day Explore tab in another dedicated video. Fundamentals, Seasonality, and Options Flow are all shortcuts to the relevant TradesViz data and trading tools pages. Clicking on any of these buttons will take you to that particular page for the current symbol you are viewing. For example, since we are viewing NVIDIA, clicking on Fundamentals will take you to the Fundamentals page of NVIDIA. Up next is the Trade Statistics. The first box on the leftmost side contains all the basic information such as price, quantity, opening and close date, commissions, and fees. To its right, you will see risk-based metrics like R-value, profit and stop target, and related statistics. Note that you can edit the stop and profit targets directly by clicking on the text or the red and green boxes respectively. The box directly below the risk statistics is the MFE, MA, and running PL statistics. We will add links to blog posts that provide in-depth information about these metrics and how you can use them to augment your trading analysis in this video's description. Clicking on the question mark also redirects you to the relevant blog post so that you can learn more about these metrics. Finally, on the left side of this box, you will see the exit statistics such as best and end-of-day exit. On the right side of this row is where you will see the interactive symbol chart of the trade. You will notice that the open and close position markings along with each individual execution are plotted. MFE, MA, stop loss, and profit targets are also plotted if available. After that, the best exit is also marked with a yellow text. This chart is highly customizable and you can even set up custom templates so that the same time frame, indicators, and chart style is shown every time you explore a trade. All of this is done via the TradesViz account settings page and we will also link resources on how to do this in this video's description. Scrolling down, you will see containers for tags and notes. You can edit these contents by clicking on the three dots icon at the top right corner of each section. Notice that all the tabs from here onward will have an arrow button at the top right corner. This is for collapsing the section. Not all traders need all the information below so you can simply click on this arrow button to collapse the section and it will be preserved for all the future Trade Explore page views. Up next is the multi-timeframe exit analysis. We will not dive into the meaning or how to use the statistics in this section, but simply put, it's the PL of your trade if you had exited at different times after your original exit. It's very useful in learning how much money you are leaving on the table and how you can change your trading style to better capture most of the profits. Next is the Executions table. The Trade Actions drop-down has several options such as Group Apply, Copying Executions, and Shortcuts for Adding Execution. The button next to it, the Recalculate Trade is another commonly used function in TradesViz. What this does is it completely refreshes all the system-generated statistics such as Unrealized PNL, MFE, MA, Best Exit, etc. This is used only when you do not see these stats for your trades. The next section is for adding a trade plan to your trade. 
Again, we will not go in depth into how this feature works. In short, trade plans are custom checklists, text, numeric and categorical inputs that you can add to your trade to represent pretty much any type of external data, like how well you have planned, how your trade execution was, what your mental state was during the trade, etc. The next section is for adding your images. You can upload your image by selecting from your local file system or just copying and pasting images into the empty container. You can add image charts to the chart section either by clicking on the chart actions and clicking on add chart or on add all active charts. Note that you need to set up chart profiles via the TradesViz account settings page if you want to have multiple auto-generated charts for each of your trades. Another interesting feature of the image charts is that they are editable. Meaning that you can draw on the chart and add text right from the TradesViz dashboard, no need to use any external tools. Once saved, your chart will always show the edited version until the chart is refreshed or regenerated. You can also edit these charts by clicking on the settings drop-down at the top of each chart and configuring the chart based on your preferences. Finally, you can change the size of the charts which will be preserved across all Trade Explore page views. The second interactive chart you see is a delayed chart of the underlying symbol of the trade. Note that since this is an external widget, we have no control over the data that is displayed here, nor is there any option for customizations. Next, we have the realized PL chart and the running PL chart. The realized PL chart shows you the PL per realized execution. Since we only have one realized execution in this trade, we see only one data point in this chart. Whereas, the running PL chart shows you exactly the PL changes for the entire duration of the trade. The final section is the similar trades section which shows trades that are similar based on the PL of the current trade. This is the end of the Trade Explore page. You may notice slight differences when you see different asset types especially for options trades. For example, in this Nvidia options trade, you may notice two extra buttons at the top of the chart that are specific only to options. A feature unique to TradesViz is that you can view the bar chart of an option itself by clicking on the View Options Chart button. The prices you see here are the prices of the actual option leg that you traded and not the underlying. This chart may take some extra time to load as querying from options data is a computationally intensive process. The other button redirects you to the options backtesting platform where you can select any options leg and simulate what your profits would have been if you had taken that trade. Resources for learning more about this feature are linked in this video's description. Other than these differences, you will also notice an extra Greek section, cost basis, along with the basic trade statistics section. All the other sections are the same as for other asset types. With this we complete exploring all components of the Trade Explore page. Explore your trades using the Trade Explore tab to learn more about your trade and also to add notes, tags, images, and trade plans. It's an all-in-one page with a lot of information in it. On top of just the trade information, using the shortcuts to explore options flow, fundamentals, seasonality, and more can augment your learning from each trade. We hope the suggestions and examples of use cases shown in this video help you understand how you can use TradesViz to learn in-depth information about each of your trades. If you have any questions, please contact us at support at tradesviz.com. Thank you for watching this video.